And my top tips for someone who's thinking of setting up a business, firstly, do it in a team. Find a group of people where you've got the same set of values, so you can trust each other, relate to each other, but have very different skills. Get someone who's obsessed with numbers, get someone who's obsessed with selling, get someone who's obsessed with operations, get someone who's obsessed with the, the crafting of the product. Secondly, make sure that the product or the service that you're making is genuinely beautiful and useful and wanted by the world. So many people miss that bit. They're obsessed because they're passionate about cupcakes. They forget that it doesn't necessarily mean that the world's gonna want them. You've got to understand the difference between a hobby and a business. The hobby is self-orientated. I do it because I love the way it makes me feel. The business has to be orientated towards the consumer. I do it, yes, because I'm interested, but mainly because the person wants it because I'm solving a problem for them and making their life better. The third thing I would say is get started. Do it small scale. We started from a market stall. Fine, it costs us 500 quid to start Innocent. We spend it all on fruit, we crushed it up, we put it into bottles and we started selling them for a market stall. But the most important thing is we'd gone from it being an academic exercise and conversation to we had started. And once you commit, then the world will sort of pile in energy and resources and favours behind you to help you get there.